All new tonight, the U.S. Marine Corps says it does not plan to move its century-old shooting range in Eva Beach. That's despite pressure from neighbors and even state lawmakers. Tonight, our Eddie Dowd has an exclusive look inside the facility that some consider a danger to the community. Today, we were taken inside this training facility where the Marine Corps made its case as to why it's trying to be good neighbors to the community. As we drove into the Pu'uloa rifle range, we could hear the loud firing of guns. It's just one of the complaints residents have been bringing to lawmakers in recent years. We were taken to Bravo Range, one of six ranges at the facility. There they go. There they go. The Marine Corps says Bravo Range alone can train up to 240 Marines at once for their annual rifle qualifications. It says that's important because 7,000 Marines on Oahu cycle through each year to complete that mandatory training. They say no other range on Oahu can accommodate all those service members. The readiness of the Marine Corps is incredibly important to national security. Uh, the level that our Marines are trained has real implications on that national security. And in Hawaii, we couldn't have fully trained uh, Marines without Pulo Range training facility. It's incredibly important. Neighborhood board members say complaints about the range increased after the yearly training moved from Kaneohe Bay to Eva Beach. The military says it can't move back to Kaneohe because different training is happening there, but says it is taking additional steps to reduce the noise. That includes sound dampening barriers along the western side of the facility. But the noise hasn't been the only concern. Last year, the Surfrider Foundation says it found high levels of lead detected in soil samples taken near the range. But the Marine Corps claims those samples were taken on the property itself. What it showed is that lead is present aboard an, uh, an active uh, firing range where the Marine Corps shoots guns that include lead bullets. So those results on their own are not cause for concern. All the issues have prompted lawmakers in both the House and Senate to approve a resolution calling on the Marine Corps to relocate. You want to protect us, but then you got to hurt us. Think about it. You got to hurt us to protect us. That's not what Ever Beach wants. Lieutenant, what's the message you're trying to send by, you know, opening the range up to people like us, the media? I think just transparency. We want the community to understand the important things that happen here at uh, Pulo Range. Now the Marine Corps says at this time it has no plans to move, but will continue to talk with state lawmakers and the community on how to be good neighbors. Reporting in Eva Beach, Eddie Dowd, Hawaii News Now.